Hi everyone. Right, I've got a wee plan. I'm going to go to Loch Ranza on the Isle of Arran. And uh, I was recently in this valley here, Glen Catacol, and I wanted to get to Loch Tanna. But we didn't have enough time, so I'd really like to try and get to Loch Tanna, which is probably the most remote loch in Arran. Um, so what I'll do is I'll probably try and come in and wild camp around about here and then head up on the evening or the following morning. The alternative is if the weather's really bad, I'll stay at the Loch Ranza campsite and I'll head in this valley possibly to Loch Nadevi and try and go around all the way down into this valley and then if I've got enough time, get to the elusive Loch Tanna. So let's see how it goes. Well, just arrived and as you can hear, a bit, of a bit of a rainstorm going on, so just as well I kind of got out of the way of trouble. It's pretty wet! Well, yeah, it's got pretty wet, so I think that was a good decision just to come to the campsite just now rather than walking this all evening. Uh, but hopefully it's just a wee thunder cloud or some passing heavy rain and this should be alright in the wee walk. So I'm just going for a wee after dinner ramble up towards Loch Davy and just leaving the distillery behind with that nice smell of malt coming off it. I've never actually been up here before but I don't think I'll go that far because it's quite late, it's about 8 o'clock. And I uh, don't really have enough time probably, but and I don't have any gear either. Anyway, we'll go and have a wee wander and see what it's like. So it's really just a recce for tomorrow for Loch Tana, but I think what I'll do is I'll head right along the path, right up to here to the call. Once I get over, that'll be to the path to Loch Tana. And what I'll do is I'll drop my camping gear, lighten the load a bit, head to Loch Tanna, the next valley, and then pick the stuff back up. I think that's the plan. Nice wee gorge, nice wee path. Looking up to a slightly more rugged ridge up there. If only. Anyway, this will do for this weekend. Let's work our way down. Alright, you can go right down by the, by the water as well. I'll carry on up the path. Nice! I'm sure I'd never discovered this before. Beautiful place. So this is the water apparently they chose for the distillery because it was in theory the purest on Aaron. To be honest it sounds like marketing bullshit to me but who knows, the whiskey's okay. Rising five minutes up the path, it feels like a different world away from the village.
absolutely wild out here and not a soul all day. Fantastic. Looking down. Huge glen. Who wants to do the coastal way when you can walk right through the middle of it? We finally made it, Loch Tanna, Aaron's most remote loch and it bloody feels it. Anyway, I'm really pushed for time now for the bus, so I was going to go to the beach and have lunch but nah, it's a long soggy plod um, and I really need to get a bit of jewelry on and back down. So I can either go via Kauri, Fee and Lochin over the top of there I think and down into Thunder Guy or all the way down into, uh, what's it called, can't remember, down the main road. So, thanks for watching folks, I better get a crack on and the battery is about to die. Hope you enjoyed it, cheers. Now that is a tempting bathtub. Just a shame I don't have the time.